Hi all, my name is Eddie Spielman. I am one of your Avery Dennison trainers. This is the Avery Dennison Academy. We are going to make a number of videos with tips and tricks for installers of each level. In this clip we are going to show you how to handle, avoid and remove tension in film using heat. Will you join me? I'm going to show you a few simple and solid techniques. There are other methods that you can use, however, what I'll demonstrate will put you on the right track for sure. During the installation you will often introduce tension into the material by squeegeeing or simply stretching the film. This tension can always be removed by using heat. Important here is that you evenly warm up the film to a temperature of 40 to maximum 50 degrees Celsius and keep the heat gun in motion. You can actually see it as well. If you warm up the film, wrinkles appear. If you then warm it up a little bit further, the wrinkles disappear again. At that moment, the film reaches this temperature. When the film has cooled down, you can feel that there is less tension in the material. Of course, if you are going to apply the film into the corrugations, you will have to warm it up again to the right temperature. I always first take away the tension on all areas of the entire panel and then start to work it into deeper parts. So work step by step. We can apply the same technique on other substrates such as the hood of the car. The unique adhesive system of the film enables you to easily lay it down. Eventually you will bring some degree of tension to the film. You gently pull the film, spread any tension, but you see you will eventually develop these wrinkles. Try to spread them as much as possible. The most critical tension, for example, like you see here on the panel's edge, will remove by using temperature. Don't squeegee down the film just yet. The adhesive is lightly touching the surface so it allows you to easily lift and reposition. Thanks for watching. If you would like to learn more, go to graphics.averydennison.eu forward slash workshops.